right guys, so in this video, I'm gonna show you guys how to make solid shapes. In other words, create a shape and fill it in with a color. But before I do that, I have to mention this. So I don't know if this was yesterday or two days ago, but someone on my website left this comment to my sister. Your forehead is very sexy, it makes me nervous. Forehead makes me nervous. See, I didn't know that anyone's forehead could uh, make anyone nervous, but uh, I have no idea. I don't know if like he doesn't speak English very well, but uh, yeah, your forehead makes me nervous. Okay there. So let's uh, get back on track here. What I'm actually gonna do is anytime you wanna create a shape and fill it in with a color, you create some kind of shape like this. So I'm just gonna copy my ugly shape and I already pasted this to the form. So I'm gonna delete everything in here except the context. Because remember, anytime you're drawing, you always need the context. And it's just, oops, it's just an object that you can use for drawing. So after we have that context, I'm just gonna paste that shape in again. So yeah, so this is like a weird looking, not a diamond, it's like, I don't know, some weird stupid shape. So that's where the context is, basically a weird looking path that's enclosed. So now let me go ahead and show you guys how to fill in this path. And my are like to fill in a path. First create a path that you can fill in, simple enough. Now if you call the method CG set fill color with color, then the first thing is, okay, what are you trying to fill in? Well, it's that context and what color do you want to use? So I'm just going to use UI color dot. What do we use before red or we use purple? Let's use it red for this one. So we're going to fill it in with red. And of course, just to make sure it's a color object that doesn't give us any errors. We need to end with CG color. Now, the last thing is remember before, whenever we created a stroke path, well, what we want to do here is we want to create CG context fill path. So there's different types of paths that you can make. A stroke path is kind of like stroking with a paintbrush. A fill path is when you want to fill a path in with a solid color. So what are you trying to fill in? Context. And this essentially just prints it out on the screen or make sure that it appears in your simulator or iPhone, whatever. So now check out this beautiful hunk of glory. So again, it's the same exact shape, but instead of having a stroke, we now have a solid shape. 